I look around and I see the world changing. Opportunities arise and so do threats. In my perfect world, everybody should feel safe, but not everybody can. I want to find ways to make it happen, to protect people and societies from hostility, fear and harm. I work hard to find new ways to overcome the impossible. By improving my skills, I want to make dreams come true. To find the best for the future, I strive to anticipate tomorrow. I am Saab. This is my story. In 1937, it was clear that Europe was on the brink of war. In Sweden, government and industry decided to prepare for the worst, and Saab was founded to meet anticipated needs. The mission was to secure the supply of military aircraft, one means of maintaining Sweden's national safety and independence. But our heritage reaches even further back in time. One of our operations was founded in 1646 in Bofors, and many years later, that operation was acquired by Swedish industrialist Alfred Nobel. But let's return to the start of Saab. Saab has always been able to do more with fewer resources. That's why we've been able time and again to present aircraft of world-class capabilities, featuring an impressive lineup of groundbreaking innovations. An early spin-off was the automotive division in Trollhättan, where Saab cars were developed and produced from 1947. In the 1960s, Saab helped create Sweden's computer, missile and space industries. Truck and bus manufacturer Scania Vabis was merged into the group in 1969. In the 1990s, car operation Saab Automobile was sold to General Motors, and Scania was made a separate company for trucks and buses. Aviation, and in particular Gripen, was the core of the company. But you could say that all these changes also marked the start of the new Saab group. Mergers, acquisitions and joint ventures were carried out with a clear objective of forming a leading defence and security company. With Celsius, including Bofors, we obtained more than a hundred years of experience in defence technologies. Ericsson Microwave brought world-leading radar and sensor developments. Grintech has substantially strengthened our presence on the African continent and Census gives us a very strong position in air traffic management. Today, Saab is active in the areas of air, land and naval defence, as well as civil security and commercial aeronautics. against military aggression, international activities, as well as threats against society and infrastructure, and even climate and environmental issues. In all these areas, we can directly benefit from our innovative culture, and we constantly find new synergies. Saab is present in every continent, with sales in more than 100 countries. We seek cooperative opportunities all over the world. To create business, 
to create jobs and to help develop the partner nation's own defence and security industry. More than half of us are engineers and over 20% of our revenues are set aside for R&D. Competence, teamwork, ethics and values are the cornerstones of our culture. Ingenuity and dedication are essentials when the seemingly impossible is a constant challenge. Our role in society is very important to us. In our vision, everybody should have the right to feel safe. And we seek ways to foresee what the future may bring, in the military context and in everyday civil life. That's why we strive to anticipate tomorrow.